In this video, let's see how you can handle a post request in your Next.js APIs. So here in one of my previous videos, I showed how to build a REST API using Next.js 14. So I already have this API route created here and I already have a function for the post. Now let's see how you can handle a post request. So for posting data to this particular API endpoint, I'll be using Postman. First, I'll just run this application, I'll run this API. Now, once this is up and running, we'll be using Postman to post some data to the particular endpoint. So, this endpoint is running on localhost 3000. I'll go to the Postman client here. I'll enter the data and the URL slash API slash users. We already have a get request on that on this particular endpoint. So I'll just for the sake of showing, I'll just show how this works. If I post if I do a get request on this particular endpoint, I get the data here as you can see down here. Now Now let's do a post request on this thing. While doing a post request, I'll be sending some data in the body as a JSON. I'll be passing in a name called Sam. Once I post the data, you can see I'm getting the response from the endpoint. So let's do one thing. We we'll just try to log. The request object here I'll save it and I rerun the post request from here now this time the request might have been logged as you can see here this is the request right so the data that we posted you can read that data using request.json so I just read the data const request request data will be request dot json you can wait on this thing and that should give you the posted data we can log this okay I just saved it I'll hit the endpoint once again now this time the data which is logged is the posted data you can read this thing also using right this way you can see if it works i'll go to the endpoint hit it again this time the data you can see we are able to read sam from the request.json so this is how you read the uh, data that is passed from the body now let's try one more thing here form data so here also you can pass in some data as form data so i'll just use the same name and samantha this data goes in as form data so now if we post this data we'll be getting a server error because we are trying to read here something else so I'll do one thing. The way to read the form data is you can use dot form data. Right. Save this thing and press data dot get. That should give you the data. Just save it. I'll just rerun the request. Here you can see we are able to read the data that we posted using form data. So this is how you can handle post request in your next JS14 API. So I hope you find this video useful. Do let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching.